that water, Julius. How cold was it? <laughs> well, the Price residence was fun for the night, but uh, it's time to race, boys. Why isn't this focusing? Ah! Hey, Julius, turn around. You got mud all over your ass, bro. Yeah, because that's like, you want to really big bill. Yeah. And he's like skirted all the way down it. Yeah, I remember that. What you think about your competition, Dad? I can, I can beat that one. You, you think you got it beat? I don't know. That one's got some horse torques. People from New Jersey, Ohio, Tennessee. Freaking crazy, man. We're here. Finally here. I guess that was better than a two hour drive. Damn, there's a baby deer. It's a dog. Julius, do you see that baby deer? Wow, yeah. Hearing all these bumblebees and all the other shows, you hear that. This is this is gonna be bad. Damn, already spinning. First hill climb and you're already spinning. This is not gonna end well for you. <laughs> no, it's not. This is not gonna end well. This is gonna be a very eventful Dude, day so bad. for both of us because I gotta help you tote this thing uphill. Dude, this is gonna be terrible. Julius, what do you think about all this? I think this is gonna be hell. It is gonna be hell, dude. I cannot read that. Row five, alrighty. Mic plugged up, good to go, good to rock and roll. This is fixing to be wild. Use code HAVOCHOUSE15, links in the description. <laughs> Thank you, Braden. Are you in 26? Oh no, 16. Do what? No. I thought I'd come here and clown around since he wanted to do it. I don't know where Julius and Chase went. A little late. Hey, are you Adam? Adam, <laughs> man! Yeah, Brayden, is Zach here? No, he was supposed to come down, but he backed out. He backed out? Y'all going to the knockout? Yeah, we'll be there. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I, I know Tom ain't here. He hardly ever races, does he? He's actually going to come to this. Oh, yeah? Yeah. He, he doesn't want to Uh huh. Well, dang. I, I recognize you. I was like, wait a second. Yeah. I was looking at your bike at first. I was like, damn, that's a nice bike. Yeah. And then I looked up at just like, uh, I, I had to do a double take. I was like, wait, there's something. Yeah, yeah. I know him. <laughs> do what? Yeah, oh, I'm racing it. Yeah. I'm going, I'm full sending it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to, but I'm going to try. Honestly, I think it'll help. It might, being able to push. Yeah. yeah. How, how far of a drive was it for you? You live in New York, right? New York, yeah, about 11 hours. 11 hours. That's a long ways. Man, am I in the final row? I think I'm in the very back. I've seen 26, 24. Now, if you guys don't know, that was Zach, ATK1's friend. Uh, I have him linked in the description. He's actually who got me started doing YouTube and started off doing motor vlogs. And uh, it took off from there, but he's Adam's actually in a lot of his videos and he's a good rider. He came all the way from New York. That shows you how big this ride is. <laughs> Damn, bro. For real. Now, how much do I have to pay y'all to get the whole shot? 
I can have it. <laughs> What's crack a lacking? They're fucking people over. I don't know how I'm gonna do it. Once I see riding around the house in Crocs, my knees aren't in the handlebars, but now they are. They even want these bar risers. Yeah, go get my dad's start. I'm not gonna lie, I'm nervous as shit. Being on this little bike's kind of scary. There it is. Oh, shit. If you don't wheel it, Bob will race the fish. All right, I feel you. There we go. Oh no, this book bag's gonna give me hell. Oh no! <laughs> Man, this is gonna be a lot more trouble than I thought! I'm working on it! It's heavy! <laughs> ah. Hey, that start was worth it though. It's gonna be a lot harder than I thought. I might not be able to do it. I mean, the plan was really was just to trail ride it and try not to get it and try not to get in anyone's way. So I'm just gonna wait because I'm in the very back. I'm gonna let some people go. Oh! I you got that. I don't know. He freaking launched that bike. <laughs> Damn! Whoa! Oh, hell no! It keeps getting knocked out of neutral every time I hit something. Every every single time I hit something, it pops into neutral. You know those logs? I was pushing on it for like a solid 10 minutes, right? It was in neutral the entire time. <laughs> no, I'm straight. Oh! People are breaking through and cutting around right there. I kind of want to go back and launch it off the tires before everybody walks off. <laughs> uh, damn, dude. It will buff. It'll buff. Have y'all seen the new horse torque stickers? Uh, uh, huh? Oh, yeah, right here. I have to get y'all some. I got them in the truck. Dude, is mine? Oh, my nice shirt. Decided to wear a button up, you know. Thought I'd look good. Dude, I'm about to go back and redo all this just so I can say I beat that guy. If I get past the tires, I'm good. Yeah, 
I beat somebody. Launch it, bro! Launch it! Alright, that tire's the smaller one, right? Should we try first or second? Third. <laughs> Take off and shut down. Damn. Damn. Ow! No, get up there! <laughs> hey, Julius, you wanna help me real quick? The bitch got my hands. <laughs> yeah, you can let go. Ah, as long as the bike's muddy and it looks like I raced, I'm good. Time to pack it up. <laughs> Thank you. Nah, no, raise hell and scrape it for Dale. I'm going to the truck. That was worth it. That was definitely worth entering the race. But, uh... That enduro track killed me. It killed a bunch of those big bikes. Some of those bikes didn't even make it through and they quit on it like I did. I feel like the trails though, I would have been just fine. But that enduro stuff, that's some big shit. That didn't go as planned. Not at all, but we had a crowd. We had a crowd. We didn't get nowhere, so I guess it's a party now. The roots are probably sliding them down. Where are they taking them? I guess they can't get up. Are they caught going that way? Uh oh, he stopped. Hey! You wore out yet? Y'all spin the tire. It helps, I swear. Spinning the tire, it just pulls it up like a tractor. Like a tractor? No, I'm telling you, it freaking grabs, man. It's like adding two wheel drive onto it. Heck yeah. He's hauling ass. Oh, yeah. Man, that is a little dude for that bike. Look. He needs to be on a KLX. <laughs> Man, they need to make a cologne out of that. A cologne? <laughs> exactly. They, they make diesel fuel cologne. You know what else? Shotgun smell. Oh, yeah. Shotgun yeah. Smell. Burnt freaking powder, dude. That smells so good. Hey, send it! Oh, that sounded like it hurt. Are you good? No, he's not good. He's about to freaking pass out. Oh. Huh? No. I got you. <laughs> this race is tough. So my dad just texted me. He said, don't even try. He thinks I'm still racing. That's a joke. Chase, I hear you, man. Down there putting in work. Hey, buddy. How's it going? Oh, gosh. Hey, yeah. He didn't make it to the first thing. I put, you know, the, you know where they cut all the wood up and they have it in that square? I pushed it through the entire thing in neutral. It won't stay in gear. And the gear, the first gear's up, so I don't know how it kept getting knocked down. So, what's your impressions on the race? Pure hell. I have no idea if you like that. How much, how, how much longer do you think you're going to be able to stay in the race for sure? Okay. You're going to finish it? Don't have a heart attack think, now. Uh, what's All the pros are quitting? Yeah. Damn. Pros are quitting. And you're staying in it. 
That's not. Is that their first or second lap? Oh, that's their first. That's their first. They haven't even done one lap, and they're already quitting. They can't get through the pro line. They can't get through the pro line. And if you don't pass pro line, you're done. You got to get by. So Shit. That's why quitting. Five point seven. Five point seven miles. You got ten more miles to finish. <laughs> Good luck. My Let me see if it's clean. I had a little thing on my. I'm side. the cameraman here. You're straight. I had a Snickers bar and a rag in it. Oh. Who found the, Who found his bag? My brother. Your brother? Yeah. yeah, he found it and brought it up. So we're straight. We got that at that uh, place back at the truck. Son of a bitch. I don't know what happened. I'm so your chain came off and it just probably locked up in there and yeah, busted right the out. case. Which I don't understand is why is the bolt out? Because <laughs> I know that motherfucker was tight. Oh yeah. I tightened it. Yeah. I've had them bust like that where the chain would snap and it'd wind up in there. But The only thing I can think of is when the chain flew off, it hooked and it just, yeah. it's not loose and it literally just it ripped just, it out. Yeah. Mm. Oh shit. Brand new bike, I mean, junk. I mean, that's not like a little part of a case. Yeah, that's, that's like the main case. Yeah, you're gonna have to split the cases and rebuild the motor. Yo, Son of a bitch. Gonna have that to race just got expensive for you. Oh. Yeah! Ah yeah! How far did you make it? You called the race. I know, that's what I was thinking. 12.5 miles. 12.5 miles, another three miles, you would have had it. You don't have any fuel left? I filled up my ladder out of the creek. No, you did not. Did you drink creek water? Oh my gosh. That or die? We're about to go to the last hill climb to see if you're going to make it in time. The last guy working it that I saw, uh -huh. he said, he said, you're number 15 of all the amateurs. Number 15 of all the amateurs? Wait, you passed five more guys? So you're about 10th place? Yeah, but I won't get nothing now. It finished. Yeah. But it ain't going to show. Yeah, it ain't going to be in the books because they called it. Too long as downhills. I ate it all the way down. This might be my last race ever. <laughs> last, first and last race ever? Oh my gosh, it was ha! I've got down in the creek and laid in the creek. Seven you laid times. seven times you laid in the creek. Putting water on my head as fast as I could. There was a guy over there that had a heat stroke and another ambulance came through with his lights on. So there might have been two. Was it worth it? Oh yeah, was it worth it? No. No. If I'd have finished it, would have. If you would have finished it, would have been worth I it. I would have freaking finished it. Them pros hadn't been so damn fast. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what's going to happen about drinking that creek water. Oh, yeah. You'll find out here in about an hour. It's yeah. not quicker. I just got done watching the GoPro footage and obviously I didn't get as far as I know a lot of you thought I was. But you gotta remember, it's a extreme enduro. Some of the top riders were riding I mean, it. I you can't, you, the logs were half the size of his front tire. My dad, he goes down there every week and he's like, yeah, it's just the size, those logs are the same size as the ones out back. And I went over those just fine. And all those logs, the logs that I did go over. I'm talking, uh, they were this big. Dude. I'm out of shape, and I, like I knew that, but I was thinking oh, I'll just take a break. I mean, you haven't ridden dirt bikes. I haven't ridden dirt bikes in forever. But uh, when I was pushing it through the damn cut-up timber section with rocks and stuff, I bottomed it out, pushed it halfway through there in neutral. It yeah. wasn't in gear. It kept popping <laughs> out of gear. So I went through that, pushed it halfway through in neutral because it popped out of gear, right? Well, then I went, and after sitting around, I went to the next thing. And immediately after I hit it, it popped into neutral, and I, don't know, I was thinking something might have been up with it because, damn, I cased it hard. And in the video, I said, "Oh shit," because I bottomed out so hard on a big old rock. And so I went over there, and there's all them fans. And I was like, "Well, shit, we're just all gonna have a party and hang out and go watch the race." And we did, and it was a good ass time. Shout out to everyone who came out. If uh, I get your Instagram, I'll put it in the description. There's probably 
anywhere from 10 to 20 uh, fans. I think the main group was about 15 that and followed. Mini, and my mini me's. Y'all don't even know about that, but it was funny. We all hung out the entire day, and it was pretty lit. Uh, it was fun. Then there's like five, six others that just came up and said, Hey, I also saw Adam. That was really cool, and apparently he knew who I was because I was like, Hey, aren't you Adam? And he was like, Yeah, you're Braden, right? And so that's pretty cool. Today was eventful. Obviously, it turned out a lot different from what y'all thought. See, I wanted to moto vlog and talk about this, but you know, that didn't really happen. <laughs> but uh, the whole point of me entering the race on the pit bike was one, for fun, two, to not have any expectations for the race, and three, you can't have a pit bike to spectate. What the hell? They put that in the rules. No no pit bikes for spectators. So I was like, well, fuck you guys. All I did was enter the race, and then I had a pit bike to spectate. And so that was pretty funny. Now, it was $80 to enter the race. Was it worth it? Hell yeah. I had fun. I might have I might have had fun for two minutes, but I had fun. Bunch of crashes, bunch of stuff happening. It was crazy. It was a good time. Would definitely do it again. But on the 250. Yeah. The 250 isn't really that set up for that kind of riding, for that kind of crazy shit. But I would definitely be able to get around a lot better because the KLX is a willy machine. It's not a extreme enduro machine, which that is a extreme enduro. Uh, people know hair scrambles oh, and I people know motocross, but extreme enduros, a lot of people don't know about that. And it's some wild stuff, like Graham Jarvis type stuff, which a bunch of riders that ride the same race as Graham Jarvis does were there. And a lot of the pro riders didn't even finish. Like, a lot of them didn't. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and close off this video. If you guys liked it, leave it down in the comments. Give me that thumbs up button because, you know what? It cost me $80 for probably 10 minutes of footage in terms of uh, moto vlogging the race. <laughs> but uh, anyway, I'll catch y'all on the next one. And uh, that was the next year. Outro I've ever heard in my life. It is a long outro, but it probably was a long video. Damn it, Julius. Now I don't know what I was talking about. Again. Anyway, we'll catch y'all on the next one.